Hello, Earth signs. We are going to do a reading. I pray that all is well with you guys. Let's see what is going on for my Earth signs. Taurus, Virgos, and Capricorns. Taurus, Virgos, and Capricorns. Okay, we have new love, message of concern, courtship. So there's a concern with someone that you're dating. 414 could be significant. You could be seeing that or their date is significant. We have new love, romantic feelings, and soulmates. And we have bad health. So, yeah, someone that you're dating is bad for your health or their health is bad. But I feel like this is like sexual health. Or like, I, I don't know, it's just, that's what it's given, so I'm going to leave it there. I don't know if like somebody is, Messing around is not good for you, and you're like, okay, miss, you, you gotta go somewhere else, go to somebody else, and then you end up hooking up with your soulmate, is what this is giving me. If that's not it, then. It's like, again, someone that you're dating bad for your health. 431 is significant also. But um, so the 14th or the 31st of this month could be significant. Someone that you're dating could be having health issues. Or like I said, this bad for your health. But I feel like this is just someone that's maybe bad for your health. And the message is getting someone new, okay, then with the romantic feelings and soulmates, like this, the new love, like a soulmate on a romantic basis. Yeah, see, there was some deception. That's why, that's where the message of concern is, someone being deceptive. Okay, earth signs, make the effort, and I feel like that is to move on. Yeah, look at that, very soon, and the other person. So somebody could be, like, sexually active with somebody else. Child of Armor, yeah, it's something like that. Somebody could be finding out that someone else is cheating. I don't fucking know, or they you did find out about it, and now you're with your soulmate making the effort. I don't know. Yeah, see, look, commitments. Saturn placements. Saturn could be doing his thing right now. Okay. Yeah, present moment. In the present moment, you guys could be dealing with a new love, heading towards this commitment with your soulmate. Or you could be in the phase of it being a concern with the person that you're dating. Just take it however. What else for my earth signs? Okay. Renewal. So it's like renewing yourself from the deception. To be feeling like things have been renewed in your life. And 
then we have guilt. So, yeah, somebody guilty of something. Someone that you're dating or you. Take it however. Commitment. Confusion. That It could be confusion with someone that you're supposed to be in a commitment with. You could be feeling like you're suffering. We have guarded. See, yeah, that's what I'm saying with this. Make that effort. We got beginning and passion. So, yeah, it's very passionate, romantic feelings. Um, don't guard yourself from your soulmate. Okay, make the effort from the start. This new love is present. That's what I feel. In the present moment. Renewing your inner child. Yeah, epiphany about some romantic feelings or about something sexual. You could be finding out something. Or you could be like realizing, okay, this is like through the amount of passion that is felt. Okay, we got attraction, water sign, and union. In the present moment, you're attracting these things to you. This privileged lady or this other person could be a water sign. Your person is a water sign. Take it however. But there is definitely suffering in a relationship, or there was. Again, take it however. Someone needing to heal their inner child. Or good. All right, let's see. Earth signs, Taurus, Virgos, and Capricorns. Taurus, Virgos, and Capricorns. Yeah, look at that. Fighting over somebody cheating. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. Crazy. That's crazy. Yeah, something being balanced out, being healed, evened out with this justice card. What's going on with this present moment? Magician manifesting, attracting things to you. Somebody has the ability, somebody is getting a vision, like if you're really intuitive, you're definitely getting a vision, a dream. Someone's like, yeah, I'm wanting a commitment. Earth signs. A wish being fulfilled. Let's see what's going on with this water sign. Clarity on water signs, please. For my earth signs. So 
somebody that you was fighting with. So again, this could be the other person or this is your person and you're fighting about them being this other person. King of Pentacles in reverse, so you could be um, an earth sign masculine. Capricorn. Okay, we got bad luck and somebody losing out on money, losing opportunities. There is definitely some fighting, some punching, some something. Yeah, see, I feel like you took a rest and then moved on. So this could definitely be like the past going on to the present. Earth signs, Taurus, Virgos, and Capricorns. Okay. That is definitely about something being in the dark coming to light. Or if it feels dark and gloomy, then there's a way that's been lit for you. Also, that is like greater than you're eating of the smaller than the mass could be significant. Um Fire, passion, energy, and enlightenment, especially of spiritual kinds. I was saying that. Clarity. Okay, Jupiter is here as well. When you find yourself stuck, a torch will provide light in your darkness to help you see the situation with more clarity. In the midst of troubling situations, you can expect a light bulb moment. A flashlight is also significant. You'll get a light bulb moment soon or that you will be able to see the end of the tunnel soon. This is all about manifestation and energy, manifesting something that you want. Your inner fire, you can light a, a powerful spark with your thoughts and energy and your energy flows into the direction of the things that you are giving your attention and your efforts to. This is also a reminder that you have everything you need to bring that project, the whatever, take on new challenges, pursue new opportunities, whatever it is that you're doing. This is like the green light. This also points to something that needs to end or be destroyed before new can happen. New growth can happen. So that's what I'm saying. It, it was definitely giving both of those anyways. So, you know, it's just up to you where you are. I know it's so many different people. Okay. Give me clarity for my earth signs, please. I 
Earth Guys, Taurus, Virgos, and Capricorns. I'll allow money into my life. I do not lack financially. Ask the universe to take away things that do not bear fruit. Allow the universe to work in your life. Taurus, Virgos, and Capricorns. Someone could be making some sort of romantic gesture. Taking the trash out. Literally. Anything that does not bear fruit, that does not, is not beneficial. Take that shit out to the trash with you. <laughs> Like, literally, not just the trash in your kitchen or in your rooms. Throw all that shit out. Hard work, payoff. And ocean breeze. So, you guys could be going to the beach somewhere. You guys could be listening to it. But I feel like with the hard work, payoff, reaching your goals, near retirement that's given florida vibes because people always go to florida when they retire yep look at that unrequited love so there was definitely some like i said some bullshit going on Like you would be creating memories. The toughest times are where you find your life purpose, your mission, your, your uh, what is that that shit that said? Uh, especially when you hard headed, your toughest lessons have to be learned. Through experience, some you know, something in that nature. Um, let's see what else. I'm definitely seeing rewards though. Yeah, your labor is not in vain. As soon as I said that, that's crazy. You could be traveling to see someone, or like I said, traveling to go to the beach, sound therapy, or you guys could be listening to the ocean breeze take it however it relates to you yeah i told you you got the green light oh wait a minute someone was talking to underage girls what the fuck Talking to underage girls. Somebody definitely broke the fuck off. This could be some shit with the government, or this you could be finding out somebody is child sex molester. Damn, Virgos, what is this? Let me see what the fuck. <laughs> the fuck going on with this talking to underage girls? Somebody being caught talking or dealing with underage girls? 
when he find out about this. Let me see. <laughs> Let me see. What, what is this? Talking to underage girls. You know how they... A king of cups. This is in reverse, but I just turned it around. So this water sign, masculine. Yep, in judgment. So this could be an official. This could be somebody that y'all know, like on a personal base. Oh, child. Or a Capricorn. No, this say motherfucking water sign. You're like, this is a goddamn water sign. What? Somebody finna get caught the fuck up. Mm -mm. The star card just fell out. So this is somebody that's a celebrity. Thank you for that confirmation. Somebody that is well known. Somebody getting busted for dealing with a minor. Sure. Yeah, definitely take a leap of faith for this new beginning. Sure. Definitely take this motherfucking trash out, please. And thank you. Okay. These folks that's got damn seven, eight kids talking shit. Trafficking their own goddamn child. Got Aquarius. A masculine is someone that can be dependable. Your surroundings matter. A bad apple can spoil the batch. Do goddamn kids on the island. These motherfuckers definitely getting caught up to it. Older man talking to younger girls. Uh, 
Alright, that's what I got for you. Love you. Bye.